All right, hey guys, Jerry from Showtime Audio. So we have this beautiful 2023 uh, 392 SCAP pack charger. And the client uh, obviously just got the vehicle. It is a very amazing color, but obviously it stands out. And so the client really would like to keep the car. He just got it. And what we ended up doing was one of our full blown security systems. Basically it's fully covered. So uh, alarm, remote start, IGLA pin code, which also not only does it keep the car from starting, it blocks the OBD from them cloning a key, and it also blocks them from being able to shift the car in the drive. So you're covered on all fronts. So basically, you go to start the vehicle, see it in the run position, lights do everything, 392, nothing happens. Hit it again, will not start, right? So I'm gonna put in the pin code. Two chirps, car starts right up. It's an amazing system. It's really well integrated into the vehicle and hidden into the harness. It would take somebody that really knows what they're doing an impossible amount of time to find it. It's the only thing that we found that works every time and keeps people from, from stealing these vehicles. Obviously nothing is bulletproof, but this is as close as it gets. So on this one, we went with the T13, again, top of the line. So this remote here has three miles of range. It has the LCD display. It's rechargeable as well as has proximity. So one of the things that we always recommend is for you to disable the passive keyless entry for the factory remote. Reason being, is that makes it easier for them to clone it and open the car. But if you disable that feature, then obviously that's not gonna work. Now, if you bought a brand new car and you have that feature where you walk up and it unlocks the door and you walk away and it locks the door by either touching the handle or just walking up and you know again touching the handle, you don't wanna lose that. So another, the way to retain that is this has proximity. When I walk away, it, the vehicle locks, and when I walk up, the vehicle unlocks. So we're gonna show you. So remote's in my hand. Car unlocks. So basically, it allows you to retain the feature, but still have the security of having an aftermarket fob. You don't want it connected to the factory fob because if they're able to relay attack the fob, not only will they unlock the doors, but they'll turn off your aftermarket security system. So this prevents that from happening. And now if we walk away, you have to give it a few seconds, the car will lock. There it goes. So I'm gonna remote start the vehicle, and I'll show you another key feature. So I'm gonna remote start the vehicle. Car starts. All right, car's running, it tells you it's running. Has our run timer, so we know how long it's gonna run for. I'm gonna walk up, the car's gonna unlock. I am going to just try and put the car in gear and drive off. So it will not let me shift. Because a lot of times we get the question, well what happens if the car's running, they get in my car, they're just gonna jump in it and throw it in gear and drive off. Well, if you don't put in the pin code, it will not let you put it in gear. So I'm gonna put the pin code in and then I'm gonna show you that I can put it in gear. So I'm gonna wait for the two chirps. There we go. Now I can put it in gear. So it's just an amazing way to protect the vehicle. It protects it you know, from, from being started. It protects it when it's remote started and it protects it even in the fact of if, if it does happen to get towed away or pushed, you, you can still find the vehicle.